Welcome back. Data download time. A record number of early voters have already cast their ballots for this week's Georgia Senate runoff. And although they're already guaranteed control of the next Senate, Democrats have more than doubled Republican ad spending for this runoff. And taking a look at the daunting Senate map they're facing in 2024, well, you'll have an idea as to why Democrats are fighting so hard to keep this lone last Senate seat from 2020 turn to blue. Let me show you. Look at the 2024 Senate map here. 33 Senate seats, 23 of them are Democratic defenses, including the two independents that caucus with the Democrats there. They caught a break. Democrat state Angus King has said he's going to seek re-election. By the way, of these 10 Republican Senate seats, not a single one of these Republican uh, seats are in states that Joe Biden carried. Not the case with this Democratic map. Look at this. Three big seats right off the bat here. In fact, if Republicans just win two of these three Trump states in the Senate, they already take control of the Senate in 2024. Montana with Tester, Sherrod Brown in Ohio, Joe Manchin in West Virginia. And all three of them were able to win re-election in 2012 when Barack Obama was seeking re-election. And they overperformed Obama in those states, particularly Tester and Manchin. Can they do it with Biden? But it's not just those three red states that they're defending. Look at the battleground states that happen to be up in 24. Pennsylvania, Michigan, Wisconsin, Arizona, Nevada, incumbent senators in all five of those states. If a Republican nominee for president carries any of these states, I promise you, it'll likely flip the Senate seat as well. On the Republican side, you just have Florida. That was in the battleground, and we don't know if Florida's going to be in the 24 battleground. Maybe Democrats target Ted Cruz. Maybe the open seat in Indiana. Not a lot of places for Democrats to play offense. That's why Georgia matters to them so much on Tuesday. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.